it's Mercedes and welcome back to my channel. So I have an exciting update regarding my braces. When I went in for my last appointment, I was just told that I was going to get new wires on my bottom braces. So she just said that I was going to get a thicker wire on the bottom braces. But then my orthodontist came over and took a look at my teeth. And he decided that not only would I be getting thicker wires on my bottoms, but that I would also be getting power chains across my top and bottom teeth. As you guys know, like I said from my last video, I do have some gaps at the top and the bottom. So the power chains are basically going to help to close those gaps between my teeth. So I'm super excited about that. I wasn't expecting that to happen so soon, but we went ahead and did the power chains. And another thing that they did, they actually put, it was basically like a wire that they twisted around. I don't know, they did something. I, I'm not sure what the name is, but it was a way in order to get my two teeth at the bottom to turn to the correct positioning. Um, so as you guys know, if you followed my previous videos, I had to get my brackets taken off and put in a different place on my tooth, actually two teeth at the bottom because they weren't turned the correct way. So this is just something else that they did in order to assist the tooth with rotating. So those two are at the bottom as well. When I zoom in to show you guys my power chains, I'll try to see if I can zoom in enough so that you can actually see that wire that is twisted on the tooth. It's really, really small. You can barely see it. Uh, but I definitely, of course, noticed it when they were basically putting them on because it was basically like a really long wire that was twisted and then cut. So it was strange, but whatever needs to be done obviously needs to be done. She did tell me that there would be some like discomfort after getting the power chains on. Even right after she put them on, she was like, can you tell the difference? Like, I'm sure you can notice. It was just like very, very tight after she first put the power chains on. And I was like, yeah, okay, I can see how this is probably going to be irritating over the next couple of days. Definitely for me, the top, they bother me some bit, but the bottom definitely was bothering me. I don't know if it was because of those wires that they put on the bottom, but whatever the case was, the bottoms did kind of hurt for the first day or two. I did take some Tylenol because at that point I was just like, this is getting irritating for me and yeah. So I definitely did take some Tylenol and that did help somewhat. It was super hard to eat certain things. Like right after I came back from my appointment, when I went home, I cooked dinner and I was like, okay, yeah, I should be able to eat these soft tacos, like no problem. I started eating and I was just like, oh, I have a headache. <laughs> So yeah, it is almost in a way kind of like that feeling when you first get your braces on. Normally when you change out your wires and things like that, it really isn't that bad. You can kind of go back to normal pretty fast, but with the power chains, it was a bit irritating. And you know, if you don't like to just have that feeling, I would definitely suggest you taking some Tylenol. It only lasted like two days, probably three days tops. And then I was back to normal. Like now I can eat pretty much whatever I want. So yeah. But yeah, I was really excited to get the power chains because I always saw people with their braces and it looked like that. And I always wondered like, well, what's that? <laughs> So yeah, they're called power chains and they are helping me to close some of the gaps that I have. So per usual, I'm going to zoom in so that you guys can see exactly what the power chains look like. And I also try to zoom in on the teeth that have like that twisted metal piece on it. But if I can't, I'll try to like link something or try to provide some additional information. But like I said, I was just told that it was going to help to rotate the teeth a little bit faster than just with the brackets on there. So yeah, let's jump right in. So there you have 
have it. These are my new power chains. I don't go back again for another seven weeks. So at that point, I will see what is next on the agenda for my teeth. Again, things are going pretty well. Hopefully I will see some differences with the power chains to see if those gaps close up. But for the most part, things are still going great. Again, if you are interested in getting braces and you have been watching these videos for that motivation, please, 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 I'm telling you, just go get them now. What are you waiting for? Again, there's tons of different payment options. You can use care credit. Uh, I would just say get a consultation, you know, check out as many orthodontist offices as you would like to get different opinions about what needs to be done, the cost and, and how long it will take. But yes, this is definitely one of the best decisions that I've ever made. I really just enjoy watching the changes as they take place. I literally started, if, <laughs> if you go back to my videos and see where I started from, it is such like a drastic difference. And you know, it is well, well, well worth the price. So if you are interested in getting braces, please let me be your motivation. Yeah, that's all I can say. I'm so happy and excited about how everything is going. And I hope you guys are enjoying taking this journey with me. As always, thank you so much for watching my video and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.